people back from my break. More daily duels we have to play here. What's up? So, uh, before we get into it, um, there won't be any Mega Chaos this week. He is actually, or they, are taking a break this week, so... I forgot what they say they were doing, but I know they're just gonna be out of town or away from the keyboard, so... No sleep. I mean, no sleep. No, Mega Chaos. No, no sleep this week, guys. No sleep. He's here, but he's oh. not here. <laughs> What's wrong with me? Oh, my God. No, Mega this week. Anyway, we're going against Sylvans, and this guy is uh, just comboing it up for a deck for a deck that relies a little bit on luck. This guy's getting pretty lucky, I must say. Okay, so that's his that's his turn and turn. No background, and no, well, Sylvans don't really play any background. I thought you maybe set like a royal decree or something. Man. How important is it that I kill the miracle fruit? Uh, I have an MST, so. You have an MST? I have an MST. Okay. Um, Alright, then I will... Troop, troop. Ugh. It has been a while. Uh, I have a video about the tournament part, but I don't really have a, a video about my experience in Utah. Outside of Gigio, so maybe I'll do a video on that. Or maybe I'll just talk about it in one episode of Dealing Duels, like I said. Not only was the the uh, the Utah regionals, but then I had a, like pretty much an entire week without having to do videos. You guys, a lot of shit happened. Took my goddamn calculus three test. Went to fucking murder myself. That was bullshit. <laughs> Swear to God. Ah, huh. uh, aren't you taking your uh, your AP calculus test? Yeah, on Tuesday. Just I don't know. I'm nervous. Oh man! Like I said, I, I got a five on it, so and yeah, I really enjoyed that test. I, I thought I had a lot of fun with it. Right. Yeah, don't <laughs> just use that big three three six trag, man. Yeah, I'm just gonna attack with the three six trag. If you have an eight, you can take a shit. I do not have an eight. <laughs> right. I don't know, man. <laughs> if I have an eight in heroic beast, then I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the Swordsman of Revealing Light. That's like a splashable eight. This card's not all that bad. He's got deep prison, doesn't he? He's oh. got deep prison. He has the back row for it. And fuck up the giant. Oh, nice. Damn, he's like, it doesn't matter. Like, I get to save my MST. I mean, there really, there's really no reason for me to overextend. Just try to get three or no? Uh, try to get two. Horse is at three. Because Trag is more powerful than Gores. Got them 3,000 guns at their mystery. Trag's also. Well, actually, never mind. I don't know. I was going to say Trag is dead more, but Gores is dead a lot too, so. With Trag, all you need to do is take damage. With Gores, yeah, you have to have no cards. If, if you have nothing in your hand, you're not. You're normally not going to summon your Trag. Unless you, I mean, you can overlay with it or steal shit. Yeah, but I'd say. you can overlay, steal shit. All you have to do is just make it the last attack. Well, if you have nothing in your hand, though, you're not going to be stealing shit anyway. So the only thing you can really do is yeah, overlay. You can draw into something. <laughs> you can just be yeah. like, yeah, I don't know. Does oh, this wow. card have any effect? Land the Rose Lover, yeah. You can banish this card from guys, but some one plant card from your hand if you do is unaffected by your opponent's draw card. Blah 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 blah. blah. Oh, okay. It's good. It's a good. It's a good card to this card with Sylvania, man. Mm-hmm. Or send with Sylvania. Alright, so he's obviously gonna summon something, excavate to go ahead and do that. That's fine. I've never been a big fan of Sylvans. Maybe that's just uh, me. I never, like, I didn't know how to play them when I tried to play them, so. I don't know. I didn't, I just don't consider myself as having ever played them. Yeah, I don't think I've ever played. They're a little bit too luck based for me, you know. And by the, when the Sylvans came out, I've already had my fill since what? When Sylvans came out, Light Swords were still on Daily Duels. So. Huh. I've had my luck fill. At least they're a little bit more controlled than, uh, than Light Swords, but. Yeah. Alright, I have. Uh, I'm gonna summon Lila. Wait, do I have a. Yeah, I'm gonna summon Lila, so I'm just gonna MST. Alright. 
The guy was so, talking about how so he's like, just in case he has the bottomless. You know what I mean? All right. Surprised he didn't miss the RMST. You know, especially during the end phase when it was my only set card. Mm. So what are you are you gonna get rid of a silt spell or what's up? Are you gonna oh, get rid God, of a I was playing a scrub, look. I thought higher level is good, but it can't be summoned. <laughs> wow. It's funny. <sighs> <laughs> Let me guess he is like Blue eyes in his hand. Like, do I have to throw the rule book at you? Oh, God. Wow. In special down here, it's not a bad card. It's just... <laughs> he's not He's not playing it because the cleave hurts, man. <laughs> oh, you have another MST. All right. Yeah. Did I get a drag? I mean, not a drag. I'm malicious. Use your mail. Yes, I kept clicking on it too. You <laughs> oh my god, we're both clicking on it. And yeah, I got a malicious. It's nice. All right, now we like Pulse Arm and like, oh, all right. And you don't play JD, right? I only play three light swords. Okay. Although now there's that search card. You don't have to worry about the swords. I can probably handle that. Yeah. It's debatable. I don't know. If you let me have a turn, then I can just use Lila, so. I'm not sure if it's gonna last that long. Like, if you wanna, like, I don't know, set up a soul charge play or something. No, I got plays. I got a ton of plays. Guy, I haven't used any resources. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. All I'm saying is that you don't have to destroy the swords revealing that if you don't, because Lila will destroy it for free next turn. If Lila survives. Uh, yeah, you're right. You're right. That's the problem. Put a, put a, put a uh, giant hand out there. I do not have any rank up cards. Uh, yeah. All I have is a whole bunch of fours, so you know we could play we could play the rank four game for a cool minute. I'm just wondering how good that face down card is. If it's worth the trouble of just throwing the MST at it, and then you know. I mean, it could be a, it could just be a simply a mind crush for Sylvans. Like, I mean, not for Sylvans, but the, the Sylvan guy said it, right? So it's... No, no, the bad guy said it. Oh, there's probably nothing. That's what I'm thinking. Or like Sakuretsu armor. I don't care if it's Sakuretsu armor. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> uh, I need to do something. I'll leave the swords there for now. You need your Lila, because I don't think it's gonna survive, and I can't change its battle position anyway. Hmm. Side, top, or bottom? Oh! Is it the Sylvan? Is he talking about a Sylvan spell? He uh, about yeah. Spell. Okay. I thought he was trying to like give a hint to his set card. I said, I'm not worried about the swords right now. Take it real slow. I'd rather get myself set up. So, you want to go ahead and kill my plain coat. I'd rather you go ahead and kill the plain coat than, uh, than just simply just get an easy attack over the Lila, because I couldn't change the battle position anyway. Yeah, I got a 22 booty, so I want you to overextend a little bit more. Because you kind of overextended to just get rid of the trag, so once again, I want you to continue overextending and burning up resources. I think your play was fine. You I have five hundred. So watch me, watch me attack and get fucking air force. <laughs> What's that new card? What's that new card? Yeah, that air mirror force. Fucking. It's not, called, it's not called air force, is it? No, they changed the name. I forgot what it's called though. I know they changed the name, though. What, what does it do again? It's like Mirror Force, except you bounce the monsters to the hand. That's not in That's not in Crossover Souls, though. That's in, um, in the Clash of Rebellion. Yeah, that's Clash of Rebellion. Alright. Alright, let's, uh... Yeah, I, I, saw it, I saw it being used today. Uh, he was going as a guy, and he was going against a Telenite player, and the man had two Altairs and a Deneb on the field, and he attacked, and he used that card. 
<laughs> like, um, why would you do that? <laughs> How many uh, eight synchros do you have? A lot. I mean, you could go ahead and MST that set card and get it out of the way, and then you can go into the scrap bills combo. Um, sounds fine. Or you could just MST the swords and then scrap bills combo his set monster, because it's probably uh, the mushroom guy, so he probably just wants to flip and excavate. Nah. Oh, yes. Sandus. Sandus. Good card. Um. That would have been inconvenient if he were, if they were smart and you went to the scrap bills combo and you did scrap effect target bills and target a card and then they chain the Phoenix chain and make your bills effect negate and you end up killing your own bills. That'd be funny. I think I'm gonna go into Crimson Blader. Well, okay. How are you gonna get rid of the swords? Uh, <laughs> Crimson Bladers bringing the swords. What do you mean? Nah, I don't know. I guess I have to go scrap, scrap mules, don't I? Yeah. Uh. All right, whatever. I said next is the bad guy's turn. So you don't have to worry about that card doing much when it's flipped. It's activates. Uh, I want to get rid of this card, so let's activate that first. Yeah, it was just so dumb. He's like, Altair, two Altairs and Deneb on the field, and he played that Air Mirror Force. I'm like, why would you do that? Why would you give him back his Altairs? <laughs> so far, I have not been impressed by that card at all. That was a terrible mill. <laughs> was it? Uh, yeah. And MST, a, a Chaos Ocean and Effect Veiler. Scrap? Did I go on? Should I put you in attack? Sure. Like I said, are you planning on attacking? Well, I mean, yeah. You just told me to do the whole thing, so yeah. Uh, I'm just wondering if that uh, that card is the... Shroom. Oh, shroom yeah, Corona Shroom. What? You get to escape five. I don't know. Okay. Uh... Let's see what happens. That was kind of risky. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, but he, he lost... Oh, wait, Lone Fire's at three. Never mind. I was going to say he lost both his Lone Fires, but... Nope. So he gets to return the draw card back to his hand. Oh, wait, nope. He, there's no draw card in there. So the only one that's going to go off is uh, Terab Sprout, which is going to summon a level one from the deck. Spore. Uh, I mean, I can't really banish it anyway. Like, I can't get rid of it besides attacking over it, so. Attack over it? Yeah. Nice. Alright, he's low on resources now, but... Should I run Felgrand or not? It's not necessary. Alright, I've always considered it. I've always considered Felgrand, I've always considered Goyo. There's just, like, a couple cards that I want to get in here that I don't run. Um, yeah, I don't know, the spoilers for the new set are out, what do you think about rarities and shit? Samuel Konami. I mean, the new shit all is secret, the, yeah. the uh... No surprise which, there. Necros of Sophia is secret, which I mean, I guess it matches, but nobody's gonna play that card, so it's yeah. kind of like gonna be cheap as shit. Draw of Avarice is secret. So is, uh, l l lose a turn. That's secret? Oh no, 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 no. It's Ultra. That's like Ultra. Uh, yeah. Galaxy Cyclone is secret. Galaxy, yeah, the, 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 the MSC, the Twister thing, right? Mm hmm. That can be searched. Yeah. By Quick Booster. So, <laughs> it's like by the, uh, there's a Galaxy card that searches Galaxy card. <laughs> Alright, well. Show us what you got, sir. We summoned your partner, Spore, so. Hopefully you can combo it off better than he could. Don't tell me you just summoned it just to defend. I swear to God, Bro. if that's what you did. 
Bro! <laughs> That's not. <laughs> that is not what you use fucking spore for. Oh man, we're gonna see it quit. You have fucking almost 12,000 life points. Like, Get the spore. You... Spore. Why? Hit the spore. Just do it. Why? Besides, a, so not a random back row. Hit the spore and put some monsters on board and do some damage. No. What yes. back row? I don't care about the spore. You said you can do how much damage can you do right now? Okay. Fine. Eight thousand. Come fine. on. Yeah. Whatever. Chill. You can put more damage on board. Okay. Okay. I'll listen to you. I know. And by listening to you, I mean when this backfires. This no, I not worth it. I, 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 I'm not. I'm not Please. overextending. There's no reason to overextend. We need right. complete control of this duel. There's no point in killing that spore. <clears throat> Why should I overextend and waste resources? To win. I don't know. Can you put on? Can you put up more damage? I could, but it's no point. I could take the duel one turn slower. What's up with you? You're so aggressive. You're such an aggressive duelist. Well, no. I just thought that. I was wondering if you could put game on board. Well, no, I couldn't. <laughs> not with that fucking yeah, scarecrow. Yeah. It's, it's not so scarecrow. <laughs> oh, I mean, scrap iron scarecrow. Scrap iron scarecrow. <laughs> oh, all the scarecrows, they're all the same. Yeah, all scraps are the same. We got scrap dragon, he's got scrap iron scarecrow. No, yep, yep. That's a generation too soon, though. Because <laughs> scrap iron scarecrow. Oh, wait, never mind. They're... Wait. Scrap Iron Scarecrow was Jaden's card or Yusei's card? Yusei. Oh, never mind then, I'm wrong. Was Scrap Dragon Yusei's card? Yes. Oh. That's pretty cool. Wait, maybe. No. No. Actually, well, no, it wasn't. Some other guy had. <clears throat> Some other guy had scraps. Damn. Oh my god. Ah! Oh my damn. He just, like, blind Sylvan Charity himself? He just wow. stack his hand? Who the fuck blind charities himself? I've never seen that before. God, he just blind charity didn't stack his hand. Okay, we win. Yeah, game we over. win. That's, that's it. That's game. Summon a monster and that's game. <laughs> yeah. That's it. Woo! Alright, we can get another duel in. Alright. Alright, bear back. What are you eating? Nothing. <laughs> 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 you think everybody heard that? <laughs> Give us some. <laughs> oh man, of course. All right. Is Tam just terrible? Awesome. It's a. Uh, oh, what do you draw? Uh, two heraldry hearts, heraldry reborn, rank up, and an amphis you know? <laughs> So pretty much, unless I unless I draw one of my summon helpers, I'm pretty much just fucked with this hand. I need a summon helper. It'd be Goldfish, Kage, Goblinburg, I don't care. It's like 12 cards that can help me. But no one mind left. I'll do something better than you. I can attack, right? Uh, You went second? I, yeah, I can attack. Okay. Man, I, want, I wish I was a great animator. I wish I, I want to get an animator to animate a vine of that. What? <laughs> Fucking just have a picture of like Dante and then have the new Dante and then have Virgil just have Virgil and then he takes off his mask and it's Dante. <laughs> Everybody <laughs> is Dante. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's not Virgil. <laughs> that's good. I like that. <laughs> um, oh, Malakota? That's just freaking Dante's Halloween costume. <laughs> Like seriously, the fusion, the fusion is Dante too. <laughs> I'm a Valor. Oh, okay. And then I'll probably do like a discussion video talking about the final burning of his cards. What's on top of his extra deck? Oh, that's the that's the rainbow card. I don't know what it is, but it's pretty. <laughs> wow. And they won. <laughs> Dante too strong. All right. Oh, we're at twenty minutes. What do you want to do? Legit, I mean, it's all up to you. We're at twenty minutes. Okay, I think we. I think we should like. I don't know. I guess we can end. It, it's up to you. You want to end or you want to go? We're gonna, up, we're, gonna, we're gonna end up doing a duel and it'll take half an hour. So I think we should just end. <laughs> okay. Well, that ended anticlimactically. I didn't even get to do anything. 
Wow. I did quit. <laughs> I guess I yeah, saw Dante I'm... and it was like, I don't want to do a Burning Abyss, even when you clearly didn't freaking <laughs> activate any Burning Abyss cards. <laughs> Bro, pitch that idea to Yugi Mansion and get them to do their thing. Yeah, I'm not... I think I think it'd be funny, because be uh, as soon as I saw the fusion, I'm just like, is everybody Dante? <laughs> oh, is yo, is today like the 10th anniversary of YouTube or something? Yes. No. Nice. Yes, yes, 10th anniversary of YouTube. Cool. I didn't know that. Nope. That's interesting. So. <laughs> so thank you, YouTube. For yeah, for uh, supporting us. Yeah. For supporting us as a <laughs> video platform. Yep. The best. <laughs> Biggest man. So huge. Have you heard about Vessel? I don't even know what that is. Um, it's supposedly a YouTube competitor. Uh, because. A lot of the, like, obviously, like, a main um, source of traffic on YouTube is music videos. Mm -hmm. And basically, YouTube has really strict um, music policies for the people that, the, for the musicians that partner themselves with YouTube. Mm -hmm. So, uh, since YouTube was, like, a monopoly for a really long time, you know, they didn't have any choice but to associate themselves with YouTube. Mm -hmm. But Vessel is taking a lot of the large musicians from YouTube as the official sponsor for the music videos. So uh, you should get a Vessel account because I think it's going to blow up. I don't care about <clears> music videos. Uh, well, no, it's not. No, no, no. Uh, there's like Smosh is on there and like, um, have you ever heard of Smarter Every Day? Like there's a lot of big YouTube channels that just moved over there because they don't like YouTube's policies. Like, uh, and there, and then that's, okay, yeah, I forgot. I didn't even tell you the kick. The whole, um, the whole, like reason that YouTubers are posting on Vessel is because Vessel has like a paid subscription early access service. So if you watch the video, you can watch the videos on Vessel before they're even posted to YouTube if you pay money. So that's just you know, that's like a niche thing, but it's an idea. I don't know. Okay, I guess. Yeah, well, I don't, it's it could be cool if it's like you know a giveaway or something. You want to get your your application in first. I don't know, man. <laughs> I mean, I don't subscribe to any like anybody special or anything. I just I just thought Vessel was a cool idea, and I think it's going to become popular. So, yep. Let's we'll see so if we can like compete. <laughs> yeah, it's a cool. Uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Because nothing else can right now. Like, there's what, Daily Motion, Vimeo. None of those. None of those guys can catch up to YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> and YouTube's run by Google, which is even bigger. So. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Google would probably just buy out anybody that. Trying to compete. Seriously, it seems like that, if Vessel gets too big, Google will just throw the fat stacks at them and be like, what? <laughs> That's a good point. Jeez, I didn't even think about that. Uh, Vessel Plus with Google. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Vessel made by? I'm going to see if there's like a, a big company name behind it or if it's just, you know, Vessel Inc. or whatever. Yep, Vessel Group Incorporated. Yep. Mm. Cool. Independent thing. All right, whatever. Uh, I'll bring it up. So let's call it. So this is, this is the... First daily duels back from my break. Yeah. Slate like didn't even know I was gone. <laughs> chill, 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 chill. I didn't. I mean, I've been worrying about school and and baseball and and shit. I mean, I mean I'm there's sure you've nothing noticed to that. worry about. You're in high school. I've, there's I've been nothing posting. to worry about. Huh? You're in high school. There's nothing to worry about. I haven't been posting. I'm losing subs. Oh, yeah, you need to start posting. Yeah, I, I know. I, I didn't. I took a week break, didn't post, and I gained a nice chunk of subscribers. Oh uh, yeah, well I well yeah, you took a week off. I took a like I'm not t taking off necessarily. I'm just not posting, but like I'm, I've I've been off for a while. But uh, like I'm 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 aware that you know I I joked about it. Like I just said that in jest. But I'm aware that I need to post. You know, like that's a thing that I should definitely do. Mm -hmm. So after I have an AP exam Tuesday, and then I have another AP exam the following Tuesday. And what's so the AP that, test? Huh? What's that? Uh, U.S. government. Nope. Nope. I got a. <laughs> I got a. I got like a two. <laughs> oh God. Well, see, like ah, uh, cause ah, uh, stop it. <laughs> scaring nope. me. Nope. Dude, I suck at government. No. Nope. It's my first AP test. Like I've never taken one before. <laughs> Shit. Oh, Whatever. No, I got a on on uh, world history. Got a one. Oh God. On um, U.S., I got two. Um, it's not. It's not history. It's it's government. I'm taking U.S. His, I'm taking AP U.S. His, history next year. Oh oh oh! Government? 
I got yeah. three. I got a three in government. Okay. I got a two yeah, in go, history, yeah. I'm history. I'm taking U.S. government this year. I got a one in biology. US history. I'm taking AP U.S. history next year. But, like, I'm not even sure if, like, wait, so, okay, you think AP, taking the AP exam is worth it, right? Like, If you get it for free? If you pay for it, then no. Uh, oh, you got it for free? Yeah, I got it for free. How? Because I don't make my mom my I don't oh, make yeah, a lot of money. Sense. Okay. Well, I mean, yeah, no, I had to pay ninety two ninety one dollars per exam. <laughs> oh well, yeah. I mean, if you if you pass it, then yeah, it's worth it. But yeah, but like I thought I was gonna pass it when I if paid. If you pass uh, it, <laughs> and now push has come to shove, and I'm you know it, it depends on if you pass it and what college you go to. Because some colleges won't take, you know, a three. Even though a three is passing, they won't take I don't, it. I don't want to publicly say what college I want to go to because it's kind of weird. But whatever. Um, all right. <laughs> what, what a tangent. My freaking biology AP test, I fell asleep and drooled all over it and then turned it in. <laughs> <laughs> Dude! <laughs> I, just, I need to, like, apply to get a scholarship to get my my AP exam for free. My mom only gets, like... Well, I'm not gonna put mom's salary out there. My mom doesn't make that much money either, so I could have probably gotten it for free too, honestly. Because I get I get lunch for free and shit. Yeah, so. you, then you you probably should have got it. Whatever. Yeah. What cool. Else? Did I take any more AP tests? Say again. I think I took like literature. I want to say no, not literature. Language. Language. AP language. And no. I... Literature. No, I got out of that class in year. I was like, nope, fuck this class. Oh man, <laughs> I don't know. English is English is stupid beyond like the point where you're learning how to read. Like I don't know, interpreting text is kind of stupid. I don't I don't know. Yeah, uh, like it's, it's supposed to help you think or something. Like I don't know. Like why do I have to know the the thematic structure and motifs present in crime and punishment? Like I don't. Yeah. It doesn't ever gonna help me. Like what is the, what is the writer's intention with the writing? Like uh, he wants to impress the ladies and get some pussy. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> Make lots of money and buy a new car. <laughs> oh, man, God. what a Christmas Carol was written in what a month? Is that what is that the, the famous the famous thing? You know, the, the story of a Christmas a Christmas Carol was written the one with Scrooge or whatever. Mm-hmm. So yeah, apparently that was written in like a month because it's a money thing. Romeo and Juliet was was written because his people, his you know, publishers or whatever the hell they had back in his day Shakespeare's day they needed money you know <laughs> so they told him to write a play about young love and he did and it was Romeo and Juliet so. it's always about money <laughs> yep exactly okay this is getting dumb <laughs> getting we dumb. literally sat here for like seven eight minutes just talking <laughs> alright yeah playing gonna end it. Just, just go ahead and sign off alright so I hope that you guys enjoyed so thank you Slate for joining me yep cool, thanks cool. for watching thanks for all the supports and I'll see you guys tomorrow with Stanzi and uh, Stu. All right, people. Thanks for watching.